What's going on YouTube? Happy Sunday everybody, it's Vikings95 here and we have a little mail day for today's uh, Sunday video. Always gotta love a mail time, got some eBay purchases, uh, I think I got a care package and uh, some stuff all the way from China actually, at least one of these packages is. So let's get to it. We have the first one, I got a pretty good deal on this, I'm pretty excited about this one. We have a Dalvin Cook veteran ticket on card auto from contenders it was a redemption that someone redeemed and uh, i purchased it off ebay so not bad not a rookie auto but a veteran auto veteran ticket and of course when you know when you get the on card autos it's a little bit cooler than the sticker autos so that is the first piece of mail for the week we have a Brees hall the cyclone state Seasons greetings from Prestige. I like these cards. I, I talk about them whenever I see them. You got the, you know, the field in the background, uh, which is pretty cool from Ames, Iowa. So um, that's actually right there. That's one of the dorms that I think I might have stayed in. I don't know. Um, it was a while ago, but pretty cool cards for the college collector. Big fan of those. And it is numbered out of four ninety nine. We have oh, this one. I'm so excited for this. So you saw it on eBay card. Uh, eBay football card of the week yesterday, but of course I had to pick one up of Brees Hall once I saw he had this card. It is the select draft picks color wheel case hit of Brees Hall in his Iowa State, the blackout uniform, super cool unis, and uh, that's just a beautiful looking card. I'll probably get that one in a one touch eventually. I'm throwing that one in the back though. Such a cool card of Brees Hall, and of course, he is out for the year, um, but he, he played really well for the Jets at the beginning of the season, so hopefully he comes back strong. Now, I think a couple of these might be the quote-unquote rejects of eBay Football Card of the Week cards. I think this, yep, this is one of them. Um, so you guys know I, I buy a lot of cards for that series, and some of them end up not making the cut. This Ryan Fitzpatrick peacock mosaic insert is one of those uh really cool card got it at a pretty decent price but just figured i've had it set aside for so long that i'm probably not going to use it in ebay football card of the week anytime soon so i'll put it in a mail day video instead so pretty cool fits magic of course i really like this parallel really unique short print this one from 2021 they started in 2020 uh so not bad with that one i think there might be one more. I can't remember which one it is. I think it might be this bottom one. Uh, but this card, we have... Oh, this is a little lot. Just a couple cards uh, that I mainly purchased for one of them that is short print and hard to find. Hard to come by because I think it's technically it could be like one per case. We have a Kane Wangu Select Rookie. And then we have this one. It is the purple. The purple parallel purple laser, which very, very hard to find. It is not exclusive to any product, I don't think. And I think it's kind of like, you know, like the Freedom or the Fire, uh, the short prints. These cards are tough to find. I've only seen a handful of them listed on eBay for uh, Kine, and most of the time they either forgot about the uh, auction or it's a higher buy it now price. But I got this one at auction, so Pretty excited about that, helping me with the rainbow, and uh, got to check one of the hard ones off the list, the purple laser, Kane Wangu. Then we have a red and blue select rookie die cut, and then the black gold select rookie die cut. So, not bad, cool lot, bought it for this one right here, and uh, the rest is kind of just icing on the cake, I guess. All right, the China package, this package... Took a couple weeks to get here all the way from China, but I got a really good deal on it. It is a Kane Wangu Optic On Card Auto PSA 7. So there's a chance I break this one out of the case and just, you know, display it how I like displaying cards. I am not the biggest fan of graded cards. I mean, if it's like a 9 or a 10, sure, but a 7, nothing really special for me. But it is numbered out of 35, and so it is a pretty sweet card, and uh, I got a good deal on it, so... Why not? Kane Wangu, optic, purple, on-card auto, numbered out of 35. Not bad. And then I think this one, 
uh, is also an eBay card of the week that I just threw to the side for a long time and then probably won't ever use. But it is a explosive, absolute case hit of Cam Newton. He is in his uh, Patriots uni, but case hit. I think these cards are pretty cool. I have a Dalvin Cook one. I think I have a Jared Goff one. Um, not as cool as the Kabooms, in my opinion, but they're also case hits. So, I mean, it's it's pretty unique, cool-looking cards there. And then we have the last package, and this is a care package from Mark. And I have not looked inside yet, so we will see what we've got here. Let's see... All right, we got a little note. Here we go. Vikings95, enjoy your channel and content. Some cards to add to your PC. From Mark, uh, his channel is Mark. He's an alien. And I can say, I can say go Steelers. I can say that. Uh, we're not playing the Steelers today. We're playing the Cowboys here in a little bit. But Mark, I appreciate you sending some stuff over. I'm excited to see what it is. I have, like I said, I have not opened this yet. So this is, uh, I have no idea. No idea what's in there. I appreciate it, Mark. Let's see what we've got. It looks like a Christian Ponder. Little jersey card right on top. Might be multiple, actually. So Christian Ponder, War Room. Jersey card. That's cool. 2011. And another one. Freshman orientation. Another 2011. Two rookie jersey cards. This one numbered out of 299 of Christian Ponder. Old Vikings quarterback. Looks like a Chris Carter die cut. That is sweet. That's just a cool looking card in general. Chris Carter. Die cut. Turf champions. Very nice. Adam Thielen, the yellow parallel from Donruss. Another Christian Ponder, certified potential. Another rookie, numbered out of 250, jersey card. And a Sidney Rice rookie crusade, a little throwback crusade, numbered out of 1,000 from Rookies and Stars. That Man, that's, I wonder how long they've had these crusade cards, because that's 2007, that's crazy. Cool card there. I like the Crusade inserts. We have, oh man, I see an AP on the back. We have a Randy Moss, Fran Tarkin, and Franchise Favorite from Bowman's Best. Nice looking card there. NFL Rookies, Percy Harvin, and his Florida, Florida Gator uniform numbered out of $5.99 from uh, Upper Deck Icons. Carl Eller, little throwback. Man, I bet this card's older than I am. And where does it say? Oh man, it doesn't even say. It's uh, unless I'm just totally missing it. First pro season. I don't think I'm missing it. It might not just have a date on it. That's crazy. I, I almost guarantee it's older than I am. <laughs> um, so that is cool. Carl Eller, old Vikes card. A theatric phase zone. I remember him. NFL artifacts. A little throwback. Ooh, in 1980 team leaders. Ted Brown, John Turner, Doug Sutherland, and Ahmad Rashad. That is cool. And what I saw in the back. Star Quest all day. Adrian Peterson. 2008. Very nice. And then we have the last one. Looks like an Adrian Peterson rookie card right there. Like a sage hit rookie of AP. And it is 20, or 2007 AP rookie Jim Klein Saucer. Oh, what a tight end for the Vikes. Scorecard numbered out of 750. Christian Ponder with the blue pulsar prism. That's cool from 2013. And a Dexter McCluster Percy Harvin. Tops Chrome. Gridiron Lineage. Mark, I appreciate all the cards. Thank you. I got to say, I think this AP is probably my favorite out of the care package. But uh, there's there's the name again, Mark. He's an alien. I appreciate the package. And I hope you all have a great NFL Sunday. Of course, I'm rooting for my cow... Or my, no, no, no. Not, I can't believe I almost said that. Rooting for my Vikings against the Cowboys. 
Go Vikings. Wow, that was a close one. Uh, rooting for my Vikes. Of course, Iowa State is pretty much, we're pretty much done for the year. Um, I don't even think we're going to get a bowl game this year. It's been a tough one for the Iowa State Cyclones. But the Minnesota Vikings are doing good, especially with that win against the Bills last week. So with that, have a great remainder of your day, everyone. Have a great upcoming week as well. Thank you all so much for watching. I'll see you later.